What's up, high levelers? It's Andrew, and I've got a really exciting feature to bring to you, which is the math calculations within forms and surveys. It's our ability to add scores to our forms and surveys for our customers in real time. It's super cool, so let me show you exactly how it works. Again, this is in forms and surveys. I am currently in a survey, and if we see on the left-hand side under our elements, all the way at the bottom under customize, we will see score. Now, how exactly do these scores work? Well, scores essentially will put together math calculations based on other fields within the foreign survey. Now, obviously these fields need to be either numerical or monetary. So you can use these two elements in order to make calculations. And whenever you're making the calculations, it will just be in the score element itself under the calculations tab. For example, if we want to add this number and this monetary field together, whenever we are in the score, we can click add field, select the number field, then click plus, and then we can click the monetary field, and then that will give us our calculation for that number plus that number. We can obviously also do slightly more complicated math calculations. So if we didn't want to do that number plus that number, we could do the number field divided by that monetary field. And then we can also add in our own numbers ourselves. So not only can we use the fields already in the form and survey, we can also add in our own numbers using the calculator itself. Now we're not gonna have crazy complicated math calculations available, but we do have parentheses, plus, minus, subtract, divide, and decimal place for making non-whole numbers. Now, for example, I'm actually using this within this form slash survey as a business idea valuation tool, which is really cool. And I'm going to be using it with my own audience. For example, using this survey, we can put together a basic business idea valuation based on a couple of different fields like the initial investment amount, the weekly time commitment, and product pricing for anyone filling out this form. So if somebody has an idea for a business, they can put in all of these different fields and they get an idea of what their business will probably be worth. Now, obviously, you can't get a completely accurate valuation for a business based on these fields alone, but it's a pretty fun way to use this scoring feature to real-time allow users to adjust their expectations when creating a business. So for example, we could say that their business is going to be worth the initial investment amount multiplied by their weekly time commitment multiplied by their product pricing by using this little user interface for selecting our fields. And if we hit save and preview, you'll see that it will work in real time. And it's a really cool way to allow your users to have some fun with your forms and surveys. So let's say we're going to invest $100 into our business. We're going to commit 20 hours a week. And then we are going to add in a product that's worth $1,000. You can see our business idea is magically worth $200,000. Is this accurate? Absolutely not. But is it fun? Absolutely. This is just one of the ways that you can use the calculations and scoring feature within forms and surveys to engage your users and create some really cool tools on the high-level platform. The only other thing to note is that these score fields are actually available to reference in other places like SMS, emails, workflows. As you can see, we have an SMS open in this workflow and we can add our contact custom field, and then we will see what our business is worth. If we look up business, we can see right here, your business idea will probably be worth. That is our score custom field. So we can even use this form with a couple of other things like automations, DMs, SMS, emails, in order to communicate this score with our users. Again, this is available within forms and surveys. So feel free to try this out for yourself. If you have any questions about how this feature works, then leave a comment. And as always, thank you so much for watching.